brand new episode of Smile with Prachi. This is Prachi. And uh, starting with the first writer of the day, let's call our first writer Ginger. Okay, so the fake name for the first writer is Ginger. Ginger says, Hi Prachi. I'm 22 years old, dating my boyfriend since 6 years. My parents are very old fashioned, very strict. My mom found out about my boyfriend while scrolling through my Instagram. She made a fake profile to stalk me and all hell broke loose. That totally against my relationship. I was literally locked inside a room for a week, beaten up and treated like a criminal. They have threatened to stop my education, even stop my sister's education and force both of us into marriage to prevent shame to the family if we even talk to any guy. My sister is just 19 and I and my boyfriend are currently pursuing MBA. None of us have anywhere to go. I am distraught. I cannot leave him. He is the love of my life. But how can I let my baby sister suffer? How can I choose between the two people I love the most? Please help. Ginger, before I move to your question, I want to send out a message to all the parents who are watching this. I know a lot of my viewers are parents of pre-teen kids or small children, toddlers, you know, if you're a parent especially. See, we really need to understand the difference between protecting a child and controlling the child. The most important part of any parent's job as a parent is to help your child grow into happy, healthy, well-adjusted adults, right? That is the job of a parent. You teach your child discipline, you teach your child uh, things about life. When they are making mistakes, you correct them. But it is all about protecting them. When it becomes when it becomes about controlling your child for your ego, for the society, then that is a big problem. As for you, Ginger, look, my advice would have been very different if you were younger, but you're 22 years old already and you've been in this relationship for, for a really long time. Looks like you know what you're doing with your life, right? So I would suggest you and your sister hold on to each other, hang on to each other and uh, just don't have to tell your parents about your relationship. Be very careful about what you're posting online. Be very careful, you know, about uh, who you are sharing your secrets with. Be very careful when you're going out and meeting people. Be very careful when you're on a call with your boyfriend. But just continue your relationship. You don't have to choose between your sister or your boyfriend. You can have both people in your lives. You just have to keep your parents out of the loop. Unfortunately, that's the situation that you're in right now. Usually, it is not advisable to lie to your parents because like I said, parents will also protect you. But in this case, it's obviously gone way out of control. It's very important for you to also understand that apart from being careful about your relationship so that your parents cannot find out, you also need to focus really well on your studies. Okay, you are currently pursuing MBA. So it's probably just a matter of time before you know you are done with your course and you can start up, you know, you can get a job and become financially independent. Financial independence is so important, right? So once you get your job, you can obviously move out of the house. You can also take your sister with you. She's already 19. So by the time you're moving out, she'll be also a little older. Maybe even she can take a part-time job and you both can live together as sisters uh, grow your grow yourself build your life and you know when you think it's the right time you can eventually think of getting married and settling down with your boyfriend as well I really think it's important for your sister also to move out of this house eventually at the earliest when it's possible for both of you of course to actually do that with financial independence because if your parents are locking you inside the room and beating you up um, treating you like a criminal that is physically and mentally very very unhealthy for you and also not good for your sister what if she's subjected to the same thing again in future for something else that she does so i think it's very important for you to play smart over here be responsible be an adult and uh, take good decisions be safe that's very important because i'm talking about lying to your parents and hiding things from your parents it's even more important that you be responsible be mature about the decisions that you take the next writer of the day, we're going to call the next writer Garlic, okay? Garlic says, Hi Prachidi, I'm a 20-year-old guy in a weird situation. My sister who is 18 watches porn on a shared family computer. My parents are convinced that it must be me and punish me whenever they notice porn on the browser history. I don't want to throw my sister under the bus, but how can I keep taking the blame pointlessly? It's so embarrassing too. How do I confront my sister about this matter without making it awkward? Honestly, garlic, you don't have to confront, confront your sister and tell her everything. You can just give her a hint and show her the way without telling her 
the whole story if you don't feel like if, if it's too embarrassing for you to confront her okay so what you're going to do is next time you sit down on the computer maybe if you guys are watching something on computer you know watching a movie or playing a game or just browsing something online just you know randomly go on the site tab and show her how to delete history just say oh you know did you know this is a really cool feature i always do this parents uh, our parents you know they are so strict they'll just keep scolding you for everything just say that to your sister and show her how to delete the browser history that's all you have to do you can also show her how to use the incognito tab and i don't know maybe they i'm i'm guessing there must be softwares and i know there are softwares to delete browser history in entirety and things like that if there is some software or if you're a computer nerd if you know about computers really well maybe you can install those things on your computer and figure stuff out as well the idea is i mean it's really nice that you are the i i see a lot of brothers still you know trying to control their younger sisters i'm glad that you understand that your 18 year old sister watching porn is not something that you should be controlling or try to change i think that's really nice so your own, so in the bottom line the only problem that you have here is that browser history does not get deleted so you teach her how to delete browser history you teach her how to use incognito tabs and uh, very importantly um if you can install some softwares and things like that that also you can do you don't have to tell her that you know that she's watching porn you don't have to tell her that you're getting scolded for watching porn that she's actually watching that should be good enough and um, yeah i i i think it shouldn't be a problem just give her that hint so yes guys that's all i wanted to share thank you so much for watching have a great weekend everybody this is me prachi signing off now bye bye